Hey guys, it's Midlife Wanderings and it's New Year's Eve and I am making Biko. I have um, black sweet rice. I don't know how long I had this but I had it for uh, probably two, three months and I need to use it. So I thought, well, today is New Year's Day, so I might as well cook it. So I'm cooking Biko for New Year's Eve, and I am mixing this brown sugar and coconut milk. I ran to my grocery store and this is what I have. I used two cans of this coconut milk. Two cans of coconut milk and I think I have a cup and a quarter of brown sugar. I normally just use one cup of, I mean one can of coconut milk, but today I have to use two because I, it's, it's kind of a doubled recipe. I have more rice, I have more sticky rice than I normally have. So, this is a what you do when you make biko, which is a sweet, sticky rice. So you just let it boil and then stir it continuously until the right stage of the syrup is achieved. I'll show you what right stage is when we get there. So you just keep stirring it. I have it on high. It's rolling boil now. It's just me, but I like to put a little bit of salt in the sugar coconut mixture. I think it gives it a balance. And I'm going to drop um, anise seeds. The anise seeds and coconut milk to me are good partners. I will take it out when I'm ready to add the rice. Okay, so here is the coconut sugar confection. That's how thick I want it to be. Not runny but not too thick either. And here is my black rice, black sweet rice. Now I'm ready to add it to the syrup. I'm gonna turn my heat down to 300. I'm just going to add the whole thing. Oops. 
So you just mix it together. And yeah, I forgot to take the anise seeds out, so we'll find it somehow. <laughs> I was supposed to discard it. It's kind of hard to find it since it's black also. Just mix it together until it, so that the rice is totally saturated with the coconut and sugar syrup mixture. And also to prevent it from sticking. You have to constantly mix it together. There's different ways of preparing sticky rice. This is one of them. This is a quick way to do it. By the way, this rice is already cooked. You have to cook the rice first before you mix it into the coconut and sugar syrup. always have this dish during Christmas or New Year's and on special occasions like birthdays and baptism and weddings the traditional way we always have this Betty White died. Wow. This would be good to eat for breakfast with hot cocoa. I mean, uh, when I say cocoa, I mean, 
the traditional Filipino cacao hot chocolate drink. This would be it would, this would be perfect to go with that drink. Mm. I like the black rice because it's nutty. It's got a nut, nutty texture to it. Instead of the white sweet rice. Very good. So there it is, guys. This is um, black sweet rice bico. Come on over and I will share it with you. And Happy New Year, guys. I will see you on my next vlog. This is Midlife Wanderings. Bye for now. I'm going to turn this walk off and let this thing sit. Bye, guys.